Halo, Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh Welcome to my YouTube channel Meta Anissa Rahim And so today, I would like to discuss about my teaching strategy in online learning And it's about student self-motivations in studying English during online learning in junior high school by using a song Okay, so before we are discuss about the strategy, we should know about online learning and student self-motivation. What is that? Let's see one by one. Okay guys, so uh, COVID-19 pandemic is a disaster for all of the world. Because COVID-19 gave an impact for all of us back in our life. For example, in economic, social life and including education it's also have a big impact in indonesia okay so this situation make a government should close all of public facilities such as school restaurant mall traditional market and etc okay as we know that education is an important part in our life and it's can't stop moreover during COVID-19. So the government applied an online learning as the solution for this situation. Or as we know, we are calling it school from home or learning from home. Okay, there are many platforms that the teacher can use in online learning such as WhatsApp, Zoom, or email or Google Classroom, Google Meet, Telegram, and etc. Okay, now about online learning. So, online learning refers to the use of internet-based technology features, which are highly depend on availability of information technology. Okay, there are several advantages of online learning. The first one is accessibility online learning provide uh, accessibility because it's make the student can learn in anywhere that they want and the second one is personalized learning online learning can make the student uh, determine their own style time and content current knowledge and individual skill the third one develop a cognitive ability and then cost efficient because in online learning we are didn't need too much uh, spend money eh, for traveling or buying a book for studying and then promote research and then basic computer skill online learning make the student have an opportunity to learn about ICT and then equal opportunity to all self-passing and then globalization okay now this advantage of online learning first poor communication okay so online learning make the student and the teacher have a poor communication because they are have a boundaries to meet i mean to have a communication face to face around the teacher and the student so they will have a light communication each other and the next one is feel isolated and the next one is lack motivation okay so in online learning they are so easily to get a distract for many things and they are need to have a self-management because as we know that if we are learning in a home or studying from home, we are can do anything that we want. For example, uh, during studying, we are can playing game or watching TV or eating, take a breakfast or lunch or anything else. And it's make the student have a low motivation or lack motivation. 
and then lack phone, and then lack of quality. Online learning also make the teacher or instructor uh, didn't take a serious for the material, and it's also have an impact for the student. They are will have a lack quality in their education. And the next one is poor accessibility in remote area. Online learning problem is not all of the people have the same connection. Not all of the people can access internet easily, especially in a village. So they are need to go to somewhere to get an internet access, and yeah, it's the problem. Okay, now about self motivation. Okay, so motivation is an important part in learning process. So, the student need a high motivation in learning, especially learning a language in a class. And then, the student that have a high motivation will be successful in learning process rather than the student that have a lack motivation in learning. Okay, so there are two kind of motivation. The first one is intrinsic motivation. Intrinsic motivation is a motivation that coming from the student self or the student itself. And the second one is extrinsic motivation. It's a motivation that coming from out of the student itself. For example, parent, teacher, and government. So now we would like to discuss about my teaching strategy that I would like to apply in my class, especially in my online class. So in this strategy, I using a song because I think song is an interest media that can teacher use in a class. Uh, as we know that mostly in our daily activity, uh, we are listening a song so using a song in a class it will increase a student motivation to learning exactly in online class okay so the title of the song is when will my life be gained it's created by mandy moore okay so with this song i would like to introduce to the student about verb one verb two and verb three this song provide a verb 1 and then the student will found a verb 2 and verb 3 and also the meaning from the word okay the reason why i using this song because this song is a soundtrack from tangle movie uh, do you know tangle it's like a rapunzel this movie production by disney and as we know that mostly all of the Disney movie is interesting to watch and also to learn because they are make the movie being a unique and interest interactive interesting and have a good visual effect okay let's see how I will use this song in a class the first one is I will have a zoom meeting with the students and then I would like to show this song in my class and then they all will listening it two or three times before it I will telling the student to write a verb that they found from this song the second one is and then I would like to ask the student to find the verb 1, 2, and 3 from the verb that they found. And then I would like to give a format from uh, verb 1, verb 2, verb 3, and the meaning of the word, and ask them to find it in anywhere they are. Can you use a dictionary or Google Translate, and etc. And then we would like to discussing it together. And then I will ask to the student to remember about the word and remember about the word because in the last meeting I will give a quiz for them. And the last one is I will ask to my student 
about the word that they remember, I will ask two or three words for every student because we all have a limited time in online learning. I think it will help the student to increase their vocabulary in English. I hope this strategy is useful for us and thank you for your attention. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and share this video. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.